Begin by getting into a comfortable position, whatever that looks like for you. Ask your body what it wants, hitting pause if you need to, and coming back when you're ready. Once you are, lovingly close your eyes. Let yourself begin to settle into your body. Just observing, noticing your breath, letting it flow however it most wants to flow, engaging your muscles however they most want to be engaged, releasing any muscles that want to be released. I will leave you for just a moment to explore what your body wants and to let yourself make any adjustments you need to, both in your breath and potentially, if called, in your posture. Either way, enjoy observing and listening to your body. With this gentle awareness of and connection to your breath and your body, allow yourself now to dive within, entering into your heart's energy center in the middle of your chest and a couple of inches inwards. Imagining your entire body is stepping into your heart's energy center. Trust how your imagination shows you this. And imagine it's as if you are entering into your own world. A magical place that is all yours. There is a red door up ahead. It is calling to you. Let yourself walk towards it. And when you're ready, you open the door and see a glorious ray of golden light streaming through. And it starts to become clear that within this door is one of the small child versions of you. Trust what age you see. Notice them smiling at you. Perhaps they're still playing with something. What do they look like? Do they have any toys or crafts with them? Or perhaps a pet? Welcome them into your heart's world. Taking their hand, walking down a path that now appears and is created with soft pink rose petals. You may even perhaps sense or smell the roses. The two of you begin to walk down this path and the more you walk, the slower you begin to move. And the more relaxed you both become. Until the two of you create an energetic bond in which you both transform into a soft pink orb of light that is slightly egg-shaped. You feel their energy with you. Their trust in life and in their loved ones. Their 
hopes and dreams. You feel what excites them, what makes them feel most free. This is more a job for sensing and feeling than it is a job for logic. If any thoughts try to interpret what's going on, instead turn your awareness back to the feeling. Raveling in how it feels to be here, to be one with the tinier version of you before doubts and limitations entered in. Enjoy sharing their energy And for them, they are receiving your nurturing, loving vibrations. As you feel a sense of appreciation towards them, a sense of love towards them. Affirming to yourself, I am that, I am. And suddenly it's as if all the versions of you across all of your life are somehow now in this soft pink egg-shaped orb of light. Just tune in to the feeling and get curious asking yourself Who was I before all of this? And at the bottom of the egg of light, a white column of light begins to enter into the sphere, the egg, the orb of light. And this white column of light sends through it this refreshing energy that feels like a returning home to who you are before all of the programming. You feel refreshed, revitalized, and every single iteration of you from every single part of your life does too. You feel every part of you sending love to every other part of you. Releasing and letting go of anything that is not you. Anything you've picked up along the way that has created doubts or limitations. It's free to go. In this moment, you return to you. Now you feel all of these different versions of you merging, flowing down into the column of white light. And that column of white light begins to grow and expand, creating one column that connects you both to the sun and to the core of the earth. Take a big deep breath into this, stomach and rib cage fully expanding, holding your breath when you reach the top, clenching your abdominal muscles if that feels good to you, squeezing and releasing with a sigh. 
at the bottom of that breath, just return to whatever pace feels good to you. You may stay with this feeling for as long as you wish. And when you're ready to come out of this, do so by truly taking your time, slowly rolling your shoulders, wiggling fingers and toes. And when you're ready, take your time as you open your eyes back to the world around you, seeing the world through this new lens, more deeply connected to who you really are.